Hello everyone. So in this video, we will use the GitHub Copilot to create a Azure YML pipeline for this create React app application. So let's first of all create uh, create an application. npx create React app. And now uh, just give the name React uh, app two. Just simply just give the name. And this may take a little while. So meanwhile, we can go to the Azure portal and create an app service for the same. So now let's create and just see a React app two. All right, and just select your runtime stack. Go with default. Looks pretty good, and let's now click on create all right now let's go to the dev.azure and here let's create a um, project called react app 2 and uh, uh, once the project is creating just create a service connection and create on create service connection and then select the Azure resource manager and next just let the load subscription and enter your credential and the password select the resource group so I'll go with uh, React App 2 group and just say that React App 2 dot connection and grant access to permission to all the pipeline. All right. Now let's go to the go back to. So let's wait for some time and I'll pause the video. All right. So our application is running now. Or now let's. Uh, Alright, the npm has been installed, so now let's try to check npm start. And it should run. Alright, so it's now running. Now let's go to the and just cancel it and go to the application and here just create a file called azure pipeline dot yml right so we just put some comments and rest of the things um, azure pipeline should give us as an ai assistant create azure pipeline for create react app project and then we will have an Azure subscription that is a service connection and then okay all right now let's start trigger master the pool that is for agent now we need a step yeah so the first step automatically it has given and we need a version just make sure that everything is correct okay, we are going for 18x so now script we required for uh, this npm install and npm run all right now two steps are done and then the third step third step is not exactly archive file but copy file uh, task for copy file okay okay so it has completed everything so now we need to just verify not we should make sure that we it should be as per our requirement so um all right so i am not interested in this thing 
yeah this time looks pretty okay all right so this is done now the next task is published artifact all right so this look pretty okay i just want to put this as an aw www all right and now uh, after publish art artifacts we need an archive i guess should come okay task for archive files okay so again we need to check that we need so much thing no okay we do not want this one we do not want this one we do not want this we just need these things and here just a build slash right now the next task is uh, after archive task for azure web app deploy now let's see what github copilot gives us okay so it has automatically taken react app to okay the app name and azure subscription what is azure subscription react app to con and react app to is our uh, yeah so it has already taken from this uh, file name web app linux okay everything is fine so here we just need to because this is manually created so i just copy this uh, portion react app to con so this is the only manual task or some sort of a changes uh, minor changes are being done by us mm, look pretty okay so now let us uh, get in it and we need um repository url so just copy here this is an azure devops repo and just add it status okay so we just need to first save it and first commit so let's see if we face any difficulty at the time of uh, no we just need one more thing i guess we are missing startup command startup command should not be this because this may little give an error so i'm expecting this uh, yeah this one pm to serve home site ww root no diamond spa so this should work in fact and then let's a uh, display name yeah right so first again pipeline updated and just do this thing copy and paste all right so now let's uh, go here and check our repo everything looks pretty fine we just need to check this thing this thing and let's let's see if we, if we get any error then we can do these things set now click on the setup build and run it so it started running and this may take a little while so i'll just pause the video so our pipeline is finished and just click on this url and check and our react app is perfectly running it's very simple 
with the help of github copilot the whole pipeline but yes it should have um, in our knowledge that how things works it just github copilot can help you to speed up the process speed up the productivity increase the productivity but yeah we need to know many of the things uh, in advance we need to learn all these things so that it can speed up the far speed up our process of programming so that's it for this video thanks for watching see you in the next video